wait to catch up with our next guest. They are two of country music's biggest superstars, mm -hmm. and they are teaming up for the 11th time to host the CMA Awards. Please welcome Carrie Underwood and Brad Paisley. <laughs> There we go. Oh. Welcome, you two. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Thank you. And I gotta ask you, we noticed you're pregnant with number two. Bit. Yeah, a little, a little bit. bit. <laughs> now, I feel like the, the second one's a little different. How are you feeling? I feel like everything just happens so much faster this yeah. time. So I feel like, like you see I'll, it faster, yeah, it's like whoa. I'll look at pictures for myself like a month plus ahead of like where I am now and I'm like, good gracious. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little bit to go yeah, still. Yes. <laughs> and you do you have your son Isaiah who's three. Yes. And and you posted a, a funny picture with a toy he can't seem to put down. Yeah, he picks interesting things to play with. He's a <laughs> Has an imagination. That's a potato, right? It is a potato. <laughs> Swimming in a donut. He had he had four of them, and um, he played with all of them for a while. And I drew faces on them, and then eventually they had to like disappear one by one, you know. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, I know what's gonna happen. He's gonna like drop one. It's gonna roll under the couch or something, and I'm not gonna find that sucker until like. Later. You later, yeah. And you wrote something like he does have real toys as well. He does, <laughs> but I mean, he has a really great imagination. And That's actually, good. the Mr. Potato Head company like sent us Mr. Potato Heads. Um, so you don't have to play with the real thing. Exactly. We've got but this now, one. now, now we have Mr. Potato Head parts like all around the house. <laughs> I'm like, oh, here's an ear. Awesome. Cool. And the CMA word, you guys, it's your 11th time hosting together. What can we expect? Can you give us any? Teaser? We, uh, every year we try to come up with something that represents sort of the, the year. And uh, this has been a challenge this year. Because it's, uh, for us, I think what's important is, is that we have fun this time. Mm -hmm. That we've, we've got to give people a respite from everything that's just been going on. So it's, it's going to be, in, in some ways, it's been more fun to write this year. Don't you think? Yeah, I, I mean, I thought, what are we going to talk about if there's, this just seems like there's a lot that are kind of like off limits right now and yeah. we just don't even want to go there. We want right. to keep it light and fun and entertaining and um, like he said, just give people a break and it was like, well, what are we going to do? And there's, there's been enough. I tell you, but you guys, you guys, I don't think you have to worry about that. You always seem to nail it. Hopefully. I mean, you always seem to nail it every single time. Well, and you nice two, but you've been doing this 11 years together. But you must be like brother and sister. So is there one annoying habit that the other would have that drives you crazy? Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> so Brad said it Thank you for done. asking. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. Oh, man, With her. I had one. No. <laughs> oh. That's not our agreement. <laughs> so then, since you have nothing, Carrie, please proceed. Backstage, we're like, we're going to agree to just say there's none. Oh. All right. What? No, I, it's, it. he knows. He, he I has do? a, you do. What he has it? a hard time being on time. Oh. oh. But that's, that's all. Like, like, like five mm. minutes, 10 minutes, an hour? It depends. I Whoa. think he's only, I think in 11 years, he's only shown up before me someplace like once. <laughs> That's when they reason. told me the wrong time is what happened. Brad, do you want to change your answer? He's like, she's annoyingly early would, to everything. I'd like to phone a friend. <laughs> He'd like to phone my husband. Yes, exactly. Well, Brad, you always wear this signature cowboy hat. The white cowboy hat. How many do you actually have? Is this the same hat? That's a that's a good question. I probably I mean I may have ten or eleven or something like that at home, but um, those are leftovers because the the company that I do this with uh, gives me these, and um, every night I put it on a kid's head. Like at the oh. end of the show, oh. end of the show, there's a little kid in the front, inevitably on his dad's shoulders or something, and he he goes home with a Stetson hat, and it's great. So. Oh, and it's a Stetson. <laughs> So there are there are thousands of those out there. Well, there that's one habit that's not annoying. I know. Not, not, not <laughs> I'm not like a jerk. No, 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 no you said I'm not like a jerk for calling him late. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. But, but he is late. So you know what, you guys, you're, you're hosting the, the CMA the 11th time, but we want to do a little game with you. Okay. We want to test your country knowledge. 
Okay? But how country the, are you? Yeah, how country are you? So okay. we're going to give you, you this blurry. sign. There's some paddles. It's going to say fake country or real country. <laughs> we're going to have to lift up. We're going to show these quotes. Brad, you're going to start us off by okay. reading the first one. And you're going to tell us, is this fake country or is this a real country and You can quote. use a country accent or like a southern accent if you want All to make right, it more country. Fine. Okay. All right, let me move out of the way so you can see it. Bam, here we go. You're lower than a snake's belly in a wagon rut. You, what do you say? Well, real say country? It's, it's you real. say real country? I think it's real. Real country! It is real country. <laughs> you in a snake's belly in a rag and rug. I'm trying to think through. Okay, I'm not smart enough The for definitions that one. is going to be part two. <laughs> Carrie, you're up. What you got? You read this you one. You gave me this one. It's drier than a popcorn fart around these parts. <laughs> <laughs> real country or fake country? I know. What's a popcorn fart? I say real. <laughs> okay, let's see. Well, I got to say, yes. it's real country. <laughs> it's real country. There you go. What is a What's a popcorn Dude. fart? You don't want to know. Maybe that's when it becomes the corn. You don't <laughs> want don't to. Don't even speculate. Okay, you just leave it there. All right, Brad. Don't hand me an eight. Uh, don't hand me an eight-legged turkey and tell me it's an octopus. I feel like that sounds like something my dad would say. I think that's <laughs> fake. That's fake. Oh! <laughs> Brad. I, I got it. Again. I want to talk to your dad now. <laughs> He's got a lot. All right, Terry, here what's, we go. What's fun about this is you don't realize how much this is killing her to be losing right now. <laughs> I feel an annoying habit coming All right. on. Oh, yeah. you, you have two more to tie it up. Here we come go. Come on, come on. Just because you have four quarters doesn't mean you have a dollar. What? That doesn't even make sense. Fake country or real country? Go with your gut. Brad, don't look at what she did and then you copy. <laughs> Sense. Not what I'm teaching my kids. And here is our final one. Bam. Fake country or real country? I couldn't buy a hummingbird on a string for a nickel. That sounds real. Yeah, I think that sounds real. That sounds real because it doesn't make, I, I think it's real. I say it right. Real country! Real. I was a hungry. So I think I nailed that. You know what's funny? I thought you were going to say, oh, it's got to be fake if it doesn't make sense. I'm like, none of them really make sense. <laughs> But you know right. you you are good. You you actually won the game, and your prize Thanks. is absolutely nothing. Hey! Very proud. Very proud right now. And we appreciate you guys. You guys <laughs> coming this. here. We. This is his prize. No, that's your prize. You get to keep that. Yeah. But you know, I gotta say, you you both are real country. You guys represent it so well. But not only country music, you transcend everything. Yeah. Love watching the show. You guys thank are you. the yeah. best host on TV. So thank you. thank you. Thank you. We will be watching the CMAs. You can catch Carrie and Brad hosting the 52nd Annual CMA Awards live on November 14th at 8 p.m. right here on ABC. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.